If you're looking for a new way to release any frustration you may have at the moment, you might want to consider getting yourself a slam ball. Slam balls can be used for a lot of exercises, such as squats, overhead presses, and of course, slamming them into just about any surface imaginable. I've been using this slam ball from Living Fit for a while now, so today I'm gonna spend some time and break down my experience for y'all. What's up everybody, it's Jake, back in the Bar Bin Garage Gym with another review for y'all. This time around, I've got a slam ball from Living Fit. In this video, I'm gonna tell you everything you need to know about this product, from the price, the features, the pros and the cons, and of course, who should or maybe should not add one of these to their home gym. But before I get going with all of that, we've reviewed a lot of slam balls on barbend.com, so if you wanna browse our best list, just go ahead and search barbend, best slam balls, and you can find out for yourself which one cracks that number one spot. Okay, so let's talk about what I like about this slam ball. Well, for starters, I really like the texture right here. You get a really good grip. You know, there's a lot of slam balls that are pretty smooth, and that's not the case here. And as you start to sweat, you know, you're getting into the nitty gritty of your workout, you're gonna be able to maintain a solid grip. Also, I like how there's a lot of buying options for you to choose from, whether that be five pounds or even 100 pounds. That's really nice. And lastly, you know, I really like how this ball is designed to absorb impact. So, you know, it's really not gonna bounce that much. Now, when it comes to those potential cons you may experience with this slam ball, you know, some people may not be too crazy about the fact that it really doesn't bounce that much and that kind of eliminates you doing some rotational throws into a wall because it's not really gonna bounce back out at you. These balls also have a sand filling on the inside and I personally think it stays pretty balanced overall, but some people may not be too crazy about that. You might wanna consider a gel filled slam ball. Texture is also a personal preference. You know, what works for me may not work for you. You know, if you don't like the grip you get right here, there's some other options out there that are a lot smoother than these are. And lastly, you know, these are not the most expensive slam balls on the market, but they're certainly not the cheapest. So if you're wanting to save some money, you can definitely find some cheaper ones out there. Speaking of money, there's a lot of buying options once again on the Living Fit website when it comes to these slam balls. The cheapest one is gonna be that five pound option. It's right around 30 bucks. The 20 pounder we have right here is about 60 bucks. 50 pound option is around $130 and that 100 pound ball is gonna cost you about 230 bucks. Now, that's not cheap by any means necessary. These are more on the higher end of things compared to the rest of the market. There's still some companies like Rogue that are gonna charge about 20 bucks or so more for their slam balls. Now, considering the quality and the amount of workouts you're gonna get in with these slam balls, I think this is a pretty good option. If you wanna save some money, you know, you can definitely find some cheaper ones that are out there. But once again, considering the high quality of this product, you know, I'm not worried about it breaking down on me anytime soon. So I think it's gonna be worth the money. Okay, so let's talk about the build now and some of the features you're gonna find with these slam balls. Obviously, you know, this is a slam ball. It has a rubber outside right here. It's got a sand filling. You know, there's some slam balls that have a gel filling. Some people think those stay you know, balanced better, but honestly, I haven't had any problems with this slam ball. I don't really think you will either. You have a really nice grip right here, in my opinion. It's a triangular pattern all the way around it. Good texture you're gonna maintain a good grip throughout your workouts. The diameter of each slam ball is gonna be directly impacted by the weight option that you're working with. So the five to 20 pound slam balls have a nine inch diameter, the 25 to 60 pound options have an 11 inch diameter, and the 70 to 100 pounders, well, those have a 13 inch diameter. All right, let's go into a quick walk around now with this slam ball. We have the 20 pound version. You know, you can see it right here, clear as day. That's really nice if you purchase more than one, you know which one is which. Now, I really like the texture pattern right here. It's triangular pattern. It gives me a really good grip. You know, my hands start to sweat a lot as I'm working out. I've told y'all that before. And I don't really lose my grip with this ball. And that's obviously really important when you're, you know, doing any type of, of slam ball workout. Now, this is a sand filled ball. And not everybody's crazy about that. I don't really have any issues with it. I haven't really noticed any type of, you know, unevenness in terms of the distribution of weight, but I definitely get it why some people would worry about that. 
And on the back right here, looks like you have a little pump. You know, you could, you know, your old classic, you know, bicycle pump for your uh, for your tires. You, know, you can just slide a little needle in there, and if it starts to get flat on you, I'm guessing that's what that's for. Now, I don't think you have to really worry about that. Now, once again, you know, this is meant to absorb the shock, so it's not really going to bounce at you. So, in terms of rotational throws, you really don't want to do that. Okay, so who should purchase one of these slam balls from Living Fit? Well, if you are in fact searching the market for a high quality slam ball, it's gonna get the most bang for your buck possible. I think this is a really good option for you to consider. If you get pretty sweaty hands as you're working out, I think you're really gonna like the texture found right here. It's gonna allow you to keep a really solid grip as you're working out. And since there's so many buying options for you to choose from, chances are there's a weight option out there that's gonna fit your needs. Okay, so what about the people who might not wanna purchase one of these slam balls? Well, let's talk about the filling. You know, once again, these have a sand filling. And sometimes people complain about, you know, the ball not staying balanced in terms of weight distribution. So, you know, if that's something you're worried about, I'd suggest checking out some gel filled slam balls instead. Texture is also a personal preference. You know, what works for somebody may not work for somebody else. So if you want a slam ball that doesn't have as grippy of a feeling, you know, there's some smoother options out there. And lastly is really just the money. You know, once again, these aren't the most expensive slam balls on the market, but they're definitely not the cheapest. So if you want to save some money, you know, go down a more budget friendly route, you can definitely do that. Well, that's a wrap on today's review over the Living Fit Slam Balls. I personally think Slam Balls are a great tool for functional training and can be a great low impact cardio workout as well. I really like the texture of these Slam Balls. It's gonna provide me a solid grip throughout the duration of my workout. And since they're high quality, I think I'm gonna be tossing this bad boy around for quite some time. There's a lot of buying options for you to choose from. And I think it's a pretty good deal, but you know, there's some people out there that may not wanna shell out the necessary cash needed to add one of these to their home gym. But if you do, I don't think you'll be disappointed. Thanks for hanging out with me, everybody. I hope this video was really helpful and I was able to answer any questions you may have about these slam balls. As always, stay posted for my next video, but for now, head over to barbend.com and you can read more about this product. Just search Barbend Living Fit Slam Ball Review. You can find all the details I talked about here today. I'll catch y'all next time.